Chapter 7 The Avengers In the evening, the magistrate and his friends are in the tavern. They are laughing about the old friar. (laughs) (laughs) Why are you laughing? asks a mysterious voice. They look at the door of the tavern and see Zorro. He has a pistol in one hand and a sword in the other. Magistrate, I am here to punish you, says Zorro. Old Friar Felipe is not a thief, and you know it. I am an important magistrate. I don't like friars because they are your friends, Zorro. Zorro gives a whip to the magistrate's friend and says, Now whip this corrupt magistrate fifteen times. But I cannot do this, says the friend. Whip him or I whip you, says Zorro. The friend whips the magistrate. After the punishment, the magistrate falls to the ground. This is how I punish dishonest people, says Zorro. The next day, everyone talks about the magistrate's punishment. A group of young men want to help Captain Ramon arrest Zorro. They look for him in the hills and in the valleys. In the evening, they go to the Vega Hacienda. When Don Alejandro sees them, he says, Why are you all here? We are looking for Zorro. We want to capture the bandit and get the reward, but now we are tired and hungry. Can you give us some food? Yes, of course. Please come in. You can put your swords and pistols near the door, says Don Alejandro. Sit down. Eat these cakes and drink this wine. Don Alejandro and Don Diego talk to the young men. At 9 p.m., Don Diego says, Please excuse me. I am tired and I am going to bed. Look, Diego, these young men are not tired. It's only 9 p.m. You are young, but you are always tired, says Don Alejandro. Yes, father, you are right. Good night, everyone. The others eat drink, and sing. At midnight, a masked man appears at the door. Look, it is Zorro, says one of the young men. Zorro Zorro the bandit! Zorro the bandit! They all say, Yes, I am Zorro, but I am not a bandit. I have principles, and I fight for them. In California, we have corrupt political men, cruel magistrates, and dishonest people. I want to change this. I fight to help the poor, the natives, and the friars. What are your principles? We want to help the poor, the natives, and the friars, too, says one young man. Our principles are the same, says another. Come with me, and we can fight together. We can make California a better place to live, says Zorro. But who are you? Where do you live? asks a young man. I can't tell you. It's a secret, says Zorro. The young men talk together. Yes, we want to fight with you. We want justice in California. Our new name is The Avengers, says a young man. Yes, yes, yes. The The Avengers, they all say. Good. We now fight together, says Zorro, and leaves. Chapter 8 The escape. The governor of California is here today, says Sergeant Gonzalez. Good, says Captain Ramon. I must speak to him. Good morning, Captain Ramon, says the governor. I have your letter. Thank you for the information about the Pulido family. They are Zorro's friends. They are traitors. We must put them in prison and kill them. They are dangerous. What a good idea. My soldiers can arrest them today, says the captain. A group of soldiers goes to the Pulido Hacienda. They arrest Don Carlos, Dona Catalina, and Lolita. They take them to prison. Don Carlos is furious. His wife and daughter cry. When Don Diego hears about this, he goes to the governor. He asks him, 
Why is the Polito family in prison? The governor answers, They are Zoro's friends. They help and protect him. They are traitors. I cannot believe this. I know them. They are honest people. They don't help bandits, says Don Diego. You are wrong, Don Diego. They must be punished. The punishment for traitors is death, says the governor. Early in the evening, Zorro sends a message to the Avengers. The message says, Meet me at midnight at the lake. Bring your swords and pistols. Pass the word to everyone. At midnight, Zorro and the Avengers meet at the lake. Every Avenger has a mask on his face. Zorro says, We are here to rescue Don Pulido and his family. They must escape from prison. They are innocent. We must be silent. Enter the prison and help them. Francisco, you take Don Carlos to the village of Pala. Jose, you take Donna Catalina to the Vega Hacienda. I want to take Lolita to Friar Felipe. They must hide for a few days. Zorro and the Avengers rescue the Pulido family. Don Carlos and Donna Catalina reach their destination. The soldiers follow Zorro and Lolita. Zorro's horse is very fast. Zorro and Lolita arrive at Friar Felipe's hacienda. Zorro says, Can Lolita stay here with you for a few days? She is in danger. Yes, I can protect her, says Friar Felipe. Zorro kisses Lolita and says, Always remember that I love you. Then he rides away on his horse. Chapter 9 The Man Behind the Mask The soldiers followed Zorro all night. They cannot capture him. The next night, Zorro silently enters the governor's home. He wants to talk to the governor and Captain Ramon. They are sitting near the fire. Zorro enters and says, Don't move and don't make a noise. I want to speak to you. He has a pistol in one hand and a sword in the other. Zorro, why are you here? asks the governor. You are here to die, says Captain Ramon. No, answers Zorro. I am here to bring justice. I am here to learn the truth. Governor, you want to punish the Pulido family. Why? They are traitors. They are your friends, Zorro. They help you. Your friends are my enemies, says the governor. They are not traitors. They do not help me. They are not my friends, he says. Look at this letter. It accuses them, says the governor. Zorro reads the letter and says, It is Captain Ramon's letter. He accuses the Polito family. Zorro looks at the captain and says, Captain, you are a liar, but I am here to punish you. Tell the governor the truth about the Polito family. Zorro puts his pistol to Captain Ramon's head and says, Tell the governor the truth or I shoot. Captain Ramon is silent. His face is white. Tell the truth, you liar, says Zorro. Yes, I am a liar. The letter is not true. This is terrible, says the governor. You are a liar. You cannot be the captain of the Presidio. At that moment, the captain pulls out his sword. He begins to fight Zorro. It is a long sword fight. In the end, Zorro kills Captain Ramon. The captain is dead, says Zorro to the governor. Outside the governor's home, there are many soldiers. They want to capture Zorro. He sees Lolita on her horse. He shouts, Lolita, come with me. We must hide in the old tavern. This time it is very difficult to escape. There are soldiers all around us. I'm happy to be with you, Zorro, says Lolita. I'm not scared. Zorro and Lolita hide inside the old tavern. 
The soldiers try to enter. Zoro is ready to fight. Suddenly, the Avengers come to rescue Zoro and Lolita. They explain many things to the governor. The governor pardons Zoro. Zoro and Lolita walk out of the old tavern. They are free. Everyone is happy and cheers. The governor says, Now that you are free, show us your face. Yes, 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 your face, show us. The people say, Zorro takes off his black mask. It's Don Diego Vega, exclaims Sergeant Gonzalez. Everyone is very surprised. My son, Don Diego, I can't believe it, exclaims Don Alejandro. Lolita looks at him and says, Is this true? Or is it a dream? Are you really Don Diego? Yes, my love. I am your Don Diego and your Zorro, he says, embracing Lolita. Lolita.